Let's begin by finding the prime factorization of 2600. We can simplify this as follows. Now the important point to recognize in this question is that every divisor of 2600 will be the product of a certain number of 2s, 5s, and 13s. So for example, one possible divisor is 2 squared times 5 to the power of 1 times 13 to the power of 1. Another possible divisor is as follows, and so on. So when determining the number of divisors of 2600, we need to determine how many 2s will be in our product, how many 5s will be in our product, and how many 13s will be in our product. Let's begin with the number of 2s. Well, since there are three twos in our prime factorization, we can have zero twos in our product, one two, two twos, or three twos. We have four possible options here. What about fives? Well, we can have zero fives, one five, or two fives. We have three options. And for thirteens, we can have zero thirteens or one thirteen. Two options. So the total number will be the product, which is 24. So our answer is D.